Hey guys, so welcome back. So today we have a collaboration with Miss Ashley. Yay! She is here on the YT as Miss um, Baddest Chick. I also follow her on IG as well. So she and I are going to be bringing you guys a wig review today. So please, after you watch me, you go over and watch her. She does have something really special and her wig will come from Sensational as well. Don't forget to go follow her on her social medias. She definitely has a great person. Ality. I absolutely love her social media pages. She's always doing something fun. She does reels and everything. She also posts outfits and she also posts wigs and things like that. So if you guys have not yet, after you watch mine, go watch her. Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel. So yay, Sensational has come out with some more What Lace Collections. So if you guys are new to this collection, this collection um, gives you incredible hairlines. This one here does come with HD Lace. The name of it is Kyra, and I have it in the Money Piece Gold Color. So the hairline is supposed to be invisible, and it's supposed to be like pre-fluffed and really, really nice. This wig is a bob, but the great thing about this, it is textured, you guys, so I'm super excited. You do get a lot of parting area with this. You get about three or four combs in this wig, um, and you do get some adjustable straps in the bag. So I love that it comes with a dark root and it comes with so many colors so here is the wig and as you can see it comes with like this 1b root and then it um, has all these different um, goldish and blondish colors in it what I'm gonna do is take those baby hairs and I'm going to go ahead on and use my hot comb and push them back into the wig as you can see the lace is pretty light on this and I'm showing you guys the hairline straight out of the pack it looks really really good so I'm just using some spray just to finagle and push those um, hairs back so that you can get a great look at this hairline and I think that this has to be a one of the best now they did start putting the HG lace on them later um, the earlier ones they made did not have the HG lace so that is why the lace um, looks so funny on it but I think that with the lace being like this you can see the hairline a little bit better so what I'm gonna do is go in and I cut it off I did measure it first and then I sprayed it with some of my Evelyn New York just to blend it in um, and when I did that I feel like this hairline just looks so so natural and looks so real you don't need much to it um, I did have some of my edges come out on the side I just kind of pushed those back and then I put a small amount of spray just in the front you guys and then I went in um, and made a couple baby hairs with this or a couple of edges and I use spray and I use some of my gel to do it with um, or you can use some um, mousse go ahead on and stay tuned for my pros and cons and also stay tuned because I'm going to introduce you guys to another wig that we will see in another review that you might be interested in as well so this is the final look on miss <clears throat> I want to say Kyra and she's gorgeous so hairline on this is really really pretty I did not have to do too much to it all I did was cut it off cut the um, lace off spray it and just lay it down um, I sprayed it with some of my Evelyn or Evelyn New York spray so this here I have is the light warm brown which um, sometimes is good it just kind of is hit or miss for me I think it depends on if the wig sometimes has a dark root or how light the lace is I don't really know I did lightly spray it with that um, I think that the hairline when it came out pretty good. So I also went in with a little bit of my Let's Jam. I put some of that down so that it would give it that fresh permed um, look or straight like it's coming from my scalp because I didn't want to use any mousse this time. I've been trying to use that a little bit more. Um, same thing in the front couple swoopity swoops with that um this hairline on this is phenomenal i showed you guys before i did anything to it that the hairline on this is great sensational did an excellent job on this wig um on this hairline i absolutely love the wig now i feel like the wig is not going to be everybody's taste number one because it is textured so getting into some pros and some cons with it the wig is textured as you guys can see when you touch it it kind of like it doesn't move as much because it does have some texture in it um the next thing is the cut on it i like it you may not i'm gonna turn around in case i have not this comes like in the front like this but it's a little bit shorter in the back so it comes around like that which i like it i think it's really pretty um but just mention it for people who don't this piece up here 
it's kind of heavy so this is the heavy the heavier piece but if you want you can go in and you can flat iron it i did put just a teeny bit of heat on it because as you guys can see she does kind of have it like swoop back into like a bangs pretty much it the color on this the style the texture the length everything to me is perfect with this wig it screams human hair it screams my hair so the only thing is when it comes to the money piece i feel like it depends on you know what they want to do with it i'm guessing the money piece is going to be these colors in the front right here you guys can see that i think that's what they mean this time with the money piece it just kind of sits in the front so yeah it's pretty versatile i actually like it i love the cut on it i love everything about this little wig i really don't want to take her off so i am going to do a small wig battle this one here was sent to me from sam's beauty as well thanks so much sam's beauty for sending me over this one they also sent me over another bob that is textured from a different brand. This one here is Cherie or Cheree. And she is also a bob and she is also coarse. She is also a 13 by 6. The difference is this one here, the lace on it is going to be tinted. So that's the lace that comes on this one. As you remember, the lace that came on the last one was, was pretty light. So this is the color of this one and this is the color of this one. So let me get close so you guys can see the textures these two this is the textures okay so you're getting the textures are about the same feel it i feel like this one here has more um the hair that's on top as you can see this hair that's on top seems like it's a little bit straighter but then the hair underneath has the texture like this one so here is how that color looks you get this color on top and then we're going to get the reddish blondish brownish color underneath so that see how that texture matches this texture but then the top is kind of like a different texture <laughs> okay you guys so again this is the final look for this wig don't forget to go over and check out the other video that's in the description box below i really like it let me know what you guys think i'll see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching.